And finally, some good news on the ongoing drug trafficking crisis along the Mexican border. Today, in testimony before the House Committee on the Judiciary, the DEA revealed it has achieved remarkable success with its latest initiative, sending rapper Lil Wayne to Mexico to use up all the drugs. Immediately upon deployment, Lil Wayne locates all the narcotics in the area and depletes the supply within hours. Operation Wheezy F Baby has been an unparalleled success. Lil Wayne has already gotten 40 tons of marijuana, 27,000 kilos of cocaine, and 2,000 kilos of heroin off the streets and into his body. Mexican officials say they expect Lil Wayne to completely wipe out the nation's drug problem by the end of next month. He is the weapon drug enforcement agencies have been searching for, a living vacuum cleaner of drugs. I personally watched him snort a pile of cocaine as tall as a man. This operation is expected to cost over $2 billion for pipes, lighters, rolling papers, and replacement diamonds for Lil Wayne's teeth. DEA officials said video field reports from Lil Wayne show he is continuing to take in huge amounts of drugs on an hourly basis. It did take off my motherfucking pinky ring and my Bentley, my Breitling, like, like, right by what I say, sparkling off the bread lane. Little Wayne's drug-stopping capabilities are, in his own words, rare like Mr. Clean with hair. Mexican officials have already commissioned a mural in Mexico City as a gesture of thanks to Little Wayne and all he has done for the nation. This is the most widespread government use of a celebrity since the 2004 Republican National Convention when Christina Aguilera was shot into crowds of protesters to disperse them. Coming up next, the White House has announced the president is in the mood for a parade.